Yo, what is going on guys? My name is Vikan Stazen2 here, and in this video I'm showing you guys an amazing overpowered glitch that I just recently discovered in which on how you guys are going to be able to be making unlimited XP, which means you can rank up as many times as you want easily by killing all these bots. You can also unlock any camo you want, and also you can unlock any calling card you want. Such as, for example, you can unlock the nuclear metal, and also this will up your KD incredibly high in which you will have like a 4.0 KD. At least that's what I have right now, but what you'll need for this glitch is you're going to need to have a friend to help you with this glitch. You're going to need to have two controllers, and you're obviously going to need to have Black Ops 2. But before I show you guys how to do this glitch, I would just like to give a huge massive shout out to two people. One, it's Psychos for actually helping me with this glitch, and two, MCS Productions for actually helping me understand this glitch, as if it weren't for both of them, I really wouldn't even be making this video for you guys right now. But anyway guys, let me sure show you guys how to do this glitch in your own game. So first of all, you'll be loading up Black Ops 2 on your main account in which you want all the XP on, and you'll be going down to COD TV, go to Community, go to most popular and you're simply just going to be looking for a custom game which is a demolition game mode and also says xp lobby now once you do find the game mode you're simply just going to be loading it up into custom games and once you do load it up into custom games you're simply just going to be saving the game mode itself you can edit the classes or whatever to change it to the guns you do want diamond or gold on but be sure to save it obviously after that you can name it whatever you want but once you have saved the game mode you're simply just going to be leaving out of that custom game and then hook up your second controller, push A to play or X and you're simply just going to be signing it in as a guest account. And this is where your friend comes in to help so what your friend is going to be doing is he's going to be going to the main menu of multiplayer, tell him to go to system link, push A on it or X and it's going to say create game. Now tell him to hover over create game, push Y or triangle to pull up the friends tab, make sure you are joinable and your friend is going to join you by pushing X or square. And right as he pushes X or Square to join you, tell him to spam A and X on Xbox and Square and X on PlayStation. Right after that, what should happen is he should be in his own lobby with no rank. Now, if your friend says he's in his own lobby and he has no rank, tell him to push B and he should be back into the main menu of multiplayer. And right after that, tell him to go back into multiplayer in his own lobby. And right after that, what you are going to be doing is you're going to be going into custom games you're going to be pushing Y or Triangle to pull up the Friends tab and simply just join your friend that just did that. Now, what should happen is, it should glitch out in custom games, you should be in your own custom games lobby and it should say like, need more players to start the game up. Right after that, just go to Setup Game, go to Change Game Mode, change it to Free For All, and then it should change from need more players to start the game up to the match is about to begin. Quickly right after that, change the game mode to the game mode that you saved earlier, which is the Demolition XP Lobby game mode. And finally, right after that, all you gotta do is just put the bots on by going to Setup Bots, go and put as many bots as you can as the enemy bots, and also change the bot difficulty to Recruit. Right after that, don't do anything else, as all you gotta do is just wait for the game to start up. And of course, whenever you do get in the game, you can choose any class you want, as I chose the Scar H class. You can get any weapon, gold, or diamond, doesn't really matter, but once you are in the game, or once the game has started up, I recommend you do put a timer on your phone for 4 minutes and 30 seconds, as if this game does not end in 5 minutes or less, then none of this XP will count, so like I said, just put a timer on for like 4 minutes and 30 seconds, but yeah guys, after that, you can do whatever you want in this game. You can get all the XP you want, get any gun, diamond, or gold, and also raise your KD even higher as my KD was like 4.0 right after this, but like I said, all you gotta do is just make sure this game ends in less than 5 minutes. If not, nothing will count. But as you see there, the game has just ended, and I was a level 41 before I did this, and now I'm a level 43. So I just quit out of the application for Black Ops 2, I'm a show proof that it does work even if you do quit out of the application. Everything does save, so once you do go back into Black Ops 2, you guys will see everything is still there, your rank, and even your challenges for your camos all unlocked, and like I said, even your KD raised up incredibly. So as you see here, I have some challenges unlocked for my camos, and I also do have my attachments all unlocked. Everything is still there. Hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I know this is nothing new at all, considering this game or this glitch has been out for like 3 or 4 years. It's just I really wanted to help you guys out with this glitch. But other than that, guys, hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Have a great day. Other than that, guys, for Kunstazen 2, signing out.